What's going on you guys? Welcome back to my channel. This is the life of Care Bear. Today we are gonna be trying this out. So I asked you guys on my Instagram and Snapchat if you wanted me to do a video on this or if I should just do it and keep it to myself. Um, this is the 23andMe kit and I've been wanting one so badly. I finally got it. I actually got it for Christmas. So here's a little box and then you open it and it says hi. What do we have here? Ooh la la, and then has all this. Ready, set, and wait. Before you begin, please review this important information. Okay, so I kind of read a little bit step by step. I need to set it up, like register the kit, so you have to download the app. So I downloaded it, and now it says I have to scan the tube that's in Scott. Wow, in Sky, inside. I seriously can't speak, guys. Okay, there's this tube here. Okay, so allow access to camera, yes. We're getting somewhere guys, we're getting somewhere. I wanna make sure I read everything. Okay, finally, it says, now you can spit. <laughs> Follow kit instructions to spit in the tube provided. So you cannot eat or drink for 30 minutes. Luckily, I haven't drank anything or ate anything. I'm actually starving right now, so this is good. So it says, spit to fill the line. Um, there's like a line here, fill up to there. That, that's a lot of spit, wait. Oh wait, oh no, there's just a little section, I think. Oh yeah, yeah, okay, I thought this was the whole thing. Oh my god, no, there's like a little section that you have to spit. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and spit. What if I don't have enough spit? <laughs> like, how do you make saliva, guys? I don't know. Um... Okay, I think we're, <laughs> we're halfway there, guys. Oh my god, okay, hold on. <clears throat> Like really, how do you make yourself spit? Do I have to think about something? Like something I want? I want chocolate right now. Or maybe some food. Think about some food. Okay, okay. I'm like dried up now. What? I'm like, it's kind of hot in here. Oh my god, I'm like sweating. Okay, almost got this, guys. I really don't have any saliva. Okay, I'm gonna look up how do you, let me see. How do you make saliva? Here's an answer from NIH.gov. Your salivary glands make saliva, a digestive juice which moistens food so it moves more easily through your. Okay, that doesn't help. It says suck on sugar-free card candies, ice chips, or sugar-free popsicles. I can't eat or drink anything. Gently rubbing the outside of your cheeks, making chewing mouth sound, okay? Oh, I got it! Yay! <laughs> it says you can gently rub the outside of your cheeks um, or make chewing motions of your mouth. Smelling or imagining sour foods such as lemons. Um, thinking about your own favorite food. Well, I did all that and I got it. But... Oh my god, it does work. Interesting. So after you spit to fill the line, <laughs> close the funnel. Okay, so I'm gonna close the funnel. like filling up there is some liquid on here and then like something's happening okay okay, okay. detach funnel and screw it detach funnel detach. oh 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 it's like wait liquid out so you have to detach this okay and screw on cap Sorry. okay it. Okay, on there it doesn't say, but I was reading the book and it said you have to shake it. Use the cap to seal, to shake food for a second. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, now seal it in the bag. Where's my bag? Here's my bag. We're almost done, guys. Okay. And then you close it. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. We did it, guys. Okay. It says the plastic container, which is this one that it came in, it says is recyclable, so if you feel so inclined. Shipping has been prepaid so you can save your stamps. You've already used enough saliva. <laughs> it's a good one, it's a good one. So we're gonna put it back in here in the box. Okay, peel here, voila. And I'm gonna close it. 
We did it, guys. Well, I should say I did it. She did it, it did it. So my kit is ready to be mailed, yes. So now I just gotta mail it and then wait and we'll come back and see what the results are. I'm so excited, yay, we did it. Okay guys, we finally have the results after waiting forever. It took longer than I thought. And the crazy part is like I got an email a couple weeks ago and it said I wasn't gonna get my results till like March 7th. So I was like, oh my God, why is this taking forever? But yesterday or the day before, so I have the app, right? And something told me just check it for some reason. And I checked it and my results were there. And I was like, oh my God, how long have they been there? So we're gonna read the results. See, and sorry, my hair looks crazy. Um, I was out in the snow today and it just, oh my God. Whatever, whatever. Leave it, leave it, leave it. Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, I already read what my results were. I just, I couldn't wait, um, but I'm gonna share with you guys. Okay, so I am 57%. I'm gonna put this on the side. So I'm 57% European, 36.7% East Asian and Native American, and 3% Western Asian and North African. And then 2.3% Sub-Saharan African. And then it just kind of breaks it down into percentages. So I'll kind of put that up on the top there too. So 55 point, almost 60% I'm Southern European. So that includes Spanish and Portuguese and then broadly Southern European. Broadly, broadly. Um, and then 0.6% I am Ashkenazi Jewish. Sorry if I'm pronouncing this wrong. Um, I suck at reading and then broadly European. I am Mexican so I'm not surprised that Portuguese is pretty much half of what I am. And then from the East Asian and Native American I'm at 36.7% so that breaks it down from Native American to 0.4% Chinese and Filipino. Wow. Um, very small percentage, but still have something in there. Again, broadly East Asian. What does it mean broadly? Like just like overall? Is that what it means? I don't know. 2.5% Northern West Asian, which is Cypria. I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, sorry. Anatolian, broadly Northern West Asian. And then 0.3 North African and 0.2% broadly. What does, what does that mean broadly? And then last, it says I am 2.3% Sub-Saharan Africa. I cannot pronounce that, 0.8%. Ah, you can read it on the side there. That, that's all my percentages there. I really thought I was gonna be somewhat part um, Italian, just because I get that a lot. A lot of people think I'm Italian, and I'm just like, really? Usually people don't know right away that I'm Mexican. They'll think like I'm Italian, which is weird. I'm like, okay, I'll take it, I'll take it. Um, so I'm kind of surprised it doesn't show, but I don't know. So nothing too crazy guys, um, but that's still pretty cool to find out. Well, I hope you guys liked this video. Um, I had fun doing it. I had fun spinning in the bottle. Um, it just took forever to get my results. Like really, I didn't know when it got posted because it told me it was gonna be here March 7th. So I don't know, but I finally got it and I can finally finish this video for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Oh wait, before I close out the video, I just wanna say Thank you guys so much. We have gained a lot of new friends on this channel, so welcome. And you guys have been showing me so much support in my last couple videos. I love you guys, keep it up, and don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in next video. Peace.